Hi there and welcome to Discover with Debs, painting tips and techniques with me Deborah Burrow. When a student gets a basic starter set with only red, yellow, blue, white and black, they often wonder whether it will be enough and whether they'll need to buy more colours. The best thing to do when you get a set like this is to do a colour wheel or a colour chart. I'll show you here how to do the colour wheel so that you can see exactly what you can get. So obviously mixing two primaries together gives you a secondary which will be green, orange and violet. Now you'll notice that when I'm mixing I put down the light colour first and then add the second colour. This really helps to get to the mix that you're after quicker without having to go back in and out of the lighter colour to try and lift the darker colour. Now going in between those colours you will get another set of hues and it's always good to do this so you can see the full range. So I've been all the way around the wheel now and just to help you create some more greens which often seems to be the problem for students is creating different greens I'll show you how to mix the complementaries which means those are the colours that are directly opposite on the colour wheel and you can create a range of different greens by doing this. So not only have you got green from mixing blue and yellow but also from mixing the complementary colours. Now we'll move on to see what happens when you add black to the primaries. And you'll notice straight away that when I add black to the yellow, it goes a kind of green, which is very useful. And what happens is when you add black is that you get a shade of a colour. This is what a shade means. And you can see that it's actually quite interesting. And you can get colours like burgundy, olive green, and navy blue. Now we'll see what happens when you add white and adding white will give you pastels otherwise known as tints. Now what gets really fun is when you take that colour you've mixed with black and add that with white and this will give you tones. So tones are adding grey which is black and white Now I hope that you found that useful, just to show that you can get more from your kit than you think. And the best thing to do is to keep experimenting to see what you can discover.